What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vale for those of you who do not know who I am. And if you're new, then please subscribe down below. That'd be fantastic. And if you're a returner, then hi, how are you doing? How I, how are you doing? Yeah, that's all right. Anyways, I look like this today because I am testing out the five top uh, predicted trending of makeup for 2018. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> Um, it, it's, it's interesting. I have plastic on my teeth. Um, it was, it was fun to do. It did not take that long at all because there really was not much to it. I didn't set my face, I didn't put powder, I didn't put concealer, like, I will tell you guys all about it in this video and what they are predicted for, predicting for 2018's makeup. So, before I just keep rambling on, let's just get into this disaster of a face. Alright, so for trend number one that I have picked out of the five, I got this from Elle. I believe they are a magazine or they're like an online magazine composure kind of thing. Um, don't quote me, I am not like trend savvy by any means, but that's a bit like out of my, out of my, out of my comfort zone if I could talk. And I haven't seen it on YouTube yet, so I really wanted to be like the first to be like, yeah, like this is how I'm gonna like walk into 2018 this year is this trending stuff. So it looks like this. I found it on Google and I did pin it just in case I didn't want to lose it. So <laughs> it's quite interesting. So the first thing I did was the eyes. I'm gonna like insert like me doing my eyes, which is like totally different for me. So let's just like roll that clip. So it's called a pop of color. Now I'm looking at this picture and there's there's no blending. There's there's no transition shades. There's no inner corner highlight. There's there's nothing. There's just color and I, I had to blend it out. I couldn't just sit there and not blend. Like that just against my religion. So I kinda of blend out the edges and this is what you're all staring at. <laughs> um kind of interesting. Moving on to the next trend, predicted trend. Um, I did these two together and so I did it like this um, in the video. So one is called um, Less is More, which they are saying that your skin needs to be the main focus, like your skin is beautiful the way it is. Um, my hair is like crimped right here, I don't know why. I'm straight into today, I'm very proud of myself. And there's a new background guy. Sorry, sorry. anyways. Uh, moving on. So yeah, so the um, less is more that your skin is supposed to be like healthy and natural and you know, so you just bring your radiance through just, you know, less makeup. And the second one is called Glow Up. Which is all about, you know, the highlights and the dewy look. So in this clip I'm doing my I'm using the Tarte uh, Rainforest of the Sea, the Radiance Drops, and then I'm blending it out with just a a um oh what are you? foundation brush, so I don't have to touch my hands too much and stuff today. And then for uh, foundation, I used a uh, CC cream, which is very lightweight. And I wanted to like make my skin look good, but like not cover everything up. I mean, my blemishes, I don't have any current like raised bumps, thankfully. I just have scarring, but it doesn't look too bad. This is too dewy for me. I don't, I don't know, like this is crazy to look at. I'm going to use my It Cosmetic CC Cream, the illuminating one. It is a pink label versus the gray label, just the normal one. And I used one layer, one coat, one full pump for my entire face. And I don't, I don't hate it, but I don't love it. I am, I like a little bit of a glow, but I am a, I like matte. <laughs> I prefer matte things. So this is insanely tense, like crazy to me. The last two things, so that was three things I just covered, so the last two things kind of go together as well. And so I did this again in that little clip. So the first one is called um, Purple Rain. And the last one is called Get Your Shine On. They both involve your lips. And the color that's in this year for lips that they're predicting is purple. And the only purple I had was the one that I show. It's the brand called Starlux. I got it in a... Um, Ipsy bag or maxi charm a long time ago. I've never used it. I don't hate it, um, but it does dry matte, which is why I used a lip gloss by. I just put it down. Um, I think it's called 
Noya. Noya. Yeah. N O Y A H. It is a um like a pinky purpley lip gloss. That's why I did the two together. And the lips are still glossy and interesting to say the least. And I didn't remember I was off camera because I need to get done. But that was the trend, like the trends that they are predicting for 2018 of makeup. So if you guys enjoyed this little, not too long of a video, but just something that I wanted to like put out there for 2018, kind of like get myself out of my comfort zone. I want to do falsies this year. I want to do like eyeliner. I want to do things that normal beauty gurus do, but I don't do because like I'm too scared or I'm just, you know, I don't think I qualify to do it. So practice is perfect and I want to do that this year. So, but yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this top predicted five makeup trends of 2018. If I see this happening in the beauty world, I'm gonna like be mind blown because there's no transition color. There's just color. There's no browns or neutrals. There's just, there's just this, like this. I, I don't even know. I'm so at a loss for words. I don't even see you guys. So yeah, you guys enjoyed this little video and I have a schedule for you guys. I did not tell you. So Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or Saturday, I haven't decided yet, will be my three uploading days. Okay. And then I'm going to film Sunday night for Monday's video, Tuesday night for Wednesday's video, Wednesday for either Friday or Saturday's video. And hopefully it works out. I can't get over this pink eye color I used. Whew. It's, it's kind of scary. But yes, that's my plan. I hope, I hope, I hope I can really stick to it and get my stuff together because I really like filming for you guys and doing videos. And yes, the background is something a lot different. I got it from Amazon for like 20 bucks, I want to say. Yes, so I have a background little holder thing. It's so fancy. So yes, moving up in the big world. <laughs> you know. But yes, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.